Hi, I'm Anne Bowditch and I'm just going to talk about physical pain. But something to bear in mind is physical pain and emotional pain are very often linked. There might be some cases when they're not linked, such as a postural issue or some sort of repetitive injury. But in many, many other cases, there is a link. And if you recall a time in your life when perhaps you felt very emotional about something, you were perhaps either scared or angry, then you probably recall a feeling within your physical body. Very often it's areas such as the chest, sometimes the throat, or even the abdominal area. So we know that what's going on for us emotionally and mentally, the body is responding to. So take physical pain. We talk in terms of the physical body. We say things like, oh, that's a weight off my shoulders. And we, we might talk about our digestion without realising it. I can't absorb that information. I just can't digest that. And so wherever we're feeling those emotions, on another level, our physical body is reacting. Now, I've worked with people to help release pain and very often um, the, the physical pain is is a side issue from them they might come in to deal with something else and they just happen to say to me oh my neck's really sore or oh my sh I've had shoulder pain for uh, five years they might say and, or jaw pain that's another really really common one partly because when we're stressed and tense we tend to hold our jaw very very tight so I often work with them to release that pain and to be honest they're quite amazed because we're not taught that something that we're feeling emotionally will come out in a physical manner. So that means we do need to address those emotional issues and there are a plethora of ways you can address them and it's always about what works best for you. Um, I use uh, techniques with my clients, um, which might include something like emotional freedom technique. And often by resolving the underlying problem, then that pain can go. Sometimes you can work directly with the pain uh, by um, noticing how intense it is and doing some tapping. So let me just show you some tapping now.